hand position. Yes, this is important, and yes, this will make a difference. So come on over to the keyboard and have a look. Do we want flat fingers? Uh-uh, no thank you very much. Do we want overly curved fingers? Uh-uh, no thank you very much. We want something a halfway house. So we want something where the energy flows down. We want something where the tips of your fingers, the pads here, those are the things that are connecting with the keys. Do we want this joint here to do that? No, we don't, absolutely not. Don't let it collapse. It's very easy to let that joint collapse. It's the biggest issue with a beginner, but try desperately to not let that collapse. And something like that is a really nice position. Do you know what though? There is no hard and fast rule. Occasionally, you will want to play with flat fingers. You can see, look, my fingers are fairly flat. I'm choosing to do that on purpose. But there's other things where I'm overly curved. So as you get a little bit more experience, your fingers become a little bit more flexible, and then you can make up your mind. What is the best hand position for you to play? But to start with, don't let that collapse. Use the pads of your fingers and have a nice curve. If in doubt, one of the easiest things to do is to find a ball, a tennis ball or something like that, or an orange, put it in your hand, hold it, move the thing away, and that is your piano hand position.